Hey everyone, it's me Mr. G. Welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to another collection video. Today I thought I'd focus on the PSP. Um, I actually love collecting for the PSP because it's a really hard system to find games for out in the wild. It's very rare you see PSP games in Goodwills or at yard sales and all that. Um, so when it comes to collecting, I'm more a quality over quantity kind of person. I prefer having good games in my collection. I don't really collect everything for my collections. I don't collect sports titles or like shovelware or anything like that. I prefer having great games in my collection instead of a lot of games in my collection. But there is two systems where I'll collect anything. That is a Nintendo 64 because I'm trying to go for a complete Nintendo 64 set. And the other one is the PSP. I'll buy anything for the PSP just because it's so hard to find that I enjoy buying stuff games for my collection. So I'll pick up everything. So over the years, I've got quite a quite a large collection, um, a lot of great titles in my collection that I found out in the wild. A lot of them came from one yard sale that my wife actually found for me. Uh, she came home some one day from uh, I think a hairdresser, and she stopped at a yard sale and she found a whole bunch of amazing games. So shout out to my wife because she's amazing for doing that. Um, but anyway, most of these games, as I always say, a couple of dollars each. And the other thing is, out of all my systems, this the PSP is probably my least played. Um, I hardly ever play on the PSP. Main reason is that I'm not into handheld gaming because I have these huge, giant hands. And playing handheld for me is so hard. The screen's so tiny. I'm blind as a bat. My hands cramp out. Even the Switch, 99% of the time I play my Switch docked. But the PSP, I hardly ever play. I mean, I have some amazing games on the PSP, but I just don't play the PSP, unfortunately. It's, it's quite a waste. But anyway, uh, let's just jump straight into it because I have quite a large collection as usual. So I better get through it as, many, as quickly as possible. So let's just jump straight in. I have WWF All-Stars. Cube. Most of these are complete in box with their booklets. Star Wars Battlefront, Renegade Squadron, Aragon, the movie, Medal of Honor Heroes, Ace Combat, Scars of Deception, ATV, Off-Road Fury, Blazing Trails, MX versus ATV on the edge. Midway Arcade Treasures. Hopefully we can fit all the games this time. From Russia with Love, 007. Siphon Filter, Dark Mirror. Splinter Cell Essentials. SOCOM US Navy SEALs Fire Team Bravo. Madden 06. Probably the only Madden game I'll ever have in my collection. I'm not into, I, I, I'm a foreigner. I don't even know how the American football works. <laughs> Pirates of the Caribbean at World's End. Uh, Buzz Master Quest. NBA Live 07. I do enjoy basketball. I'm not going to lie. And baseball. I love baseball. Go Dodgers! Uh, Thrillville. Call of Duty Roads to Victory. UFC Undisputed 2010. Field Commander. G.I. Joe The Rise of Cobra. So I've never even put any of these games in my system, let alone play them. Uh, mainly because none of these games I've ever played. Uh, this is a pretty good one. Death Jr. Marvel Nemesis Rise of the Imperfects. Pretty good game. Killzone Liberation. I actually have played that. That's pretty good. But it's okay. Compared to the other Killzones. Uh, these I found at Goodwill. They're pretty expensive games. And I found them for super cheap. Popolocross? Popolocross, I think. They're quite an expensive one. Mercury, that's actually a pretty good game. I've played that. Uh, Downstream Panic. I can't remember what that is. Scarface. Deadhead Fred. I've never played that. I don't even know what that is. 
Super Monkey Ball Adventure. Super Monkey Ball games are pretty cool. Worms Open Warfare. That's a pretty cool game. Uh, the Con. I don't know what that is. Uh, Lemons. That's also been around forever. Really cool. Coated Arms. Sonic Rivals. That's pretty good. Family Guy. N Plus is a pretty cool game. Hot Shots Golf. That's pretty good. Need for Speed Underground Rivals. The Need for Speed games on the PSP are, are really good. Uh, Need for Speed Carbon on the City. Need for Speed Most Wanted. That's a really great game on the system. Uh, really amazing game on the system. Burning, Burnout Legends. The Burnout series is one of my favorite racing series. Uh, this is actually from my home country. We had PAL uh, games, but they work on all PSPs because the PSP is region free. Burnout Dominator, you can tell it's PAL because it's got a gray box. And then this is the this is the good games now. We're getting into good games. Ratchet and Clank Size Matters. That's a great game. Tony Hawk Underground 2 Remix, which is shot up in process. It's actually worth quite a lot of money now. Really good on the PSP. Another PAL version. Motor Storm Arctic Edge. You can tell it's PAL because of the, the cover and the box. Let's start piling these up now. Daxter, great PSP game. God of War Chains of Olympus. God of War games on the PSP are really good. Um, so I think... So this, these games were from the yard sale. These all my wife found. She found a PSP system and a whole stack of games. I think she paid 40 or 60. Um, so yeah, she actually ended up getting most of the best games for my system. So as I said before, shout out to my wife. Star Ocean First Departure was in there. Me and My Katamari was in there. Grand Theft Auto Liberty Stories was in that. Uh, Twisted Metal Head On was in there. I don't think this was in the lot. I think this was a good one found. Tokobite. Uh, this was in there. Medieval Resurrection, which is a really great series. Tech and Dark Resurrection. I think that was in the lot. Uh, this was in the lot. This is a great game to have. Valkyria. Valkyrie Profile. Valkyrie Profile. That's pretty cool. That was in the lot. This was a Goodwill find, Namco Museum. Uh, this was in the lot, I believe. Lumineers, Lumineers, I don't know, whatever. Uh, this was a Goodwill score. Uh, it's also a pretty expensive game. Innocent Life. I believe it's like, um, what is that series? The farming series. Uh, anyway, um, this was in the lot. This is actually probably the best score of the whole lot. Castlevania The Dracula X Chronicles. That's actually a really great game on a PSP. It doesn't have the manual, unfortunately. But still, to have that in the collection is pretty amazing. Another one that I got from back home is Power, which is great. Darkstalker Chronicles. That's a great game on a PSP. Uh, another one from back home. Uh, Street Fighter Alpha 3 Max. Another great fighting series on the PSP. Uh, this was in the lot. Sega Genesis Collection. That's amazing. That's like 30 games, I believe, in, in one cartridge and one thing. Loco Roco, I really like the Loco Roco series. That's pretty cool. Uh, Outrun 2006 Coast to Coast, which is, I believe, quite an expensive game now. That I picked up off Opera. It's from some woman. Uh, Patapon 3, Patapon 1, 2, and 3, which is also a great series to have. Really like that series on the PSP. Uh, let's see. Crisis Crawl Crisis Core Final Fantasy. That's a great game on the PSP. Uh, let's see. My favorite fighting series of all time. Soul Calibur Broken Destiny. I love the Soul Calibur series. Ape Escape on the Floor was in that light. Final Fantasy 2 was in that light. Uh, also, one of my favorite racing series, the Wi-Fi series. This is Wi-Fi Pulse and Wi-Fi Pure. These games are pretty amazing on the PSP. And, oh, okay, here we go again. I have two copies of Wi-Fi Pure. One is from back home and one I must have picked up here. Um, 
Maybe I'll keep that because they're two different versions of the covers. I don't think I'll sell them on eBay. Two copies of PSP of Wipe of Pure. Pursuit Force, which is a pretty cool game on the PSP. And then the last one, which is probably the most expensive one. I actually picked this up in New York City uh, from a really amazing uh, video game store in the East Village. A little tiny store that has like every game under the sun. Silent Hill Origins, which is worth a fortune, especially on the PlayStation 2 now. And then I have uh, a few loose games, because I don't have boxes for them. I have Metal Gear Solid Acid, Metal Gear Solid Portable Ops, Metal Gear Solid Peace Walker, Valkyria Knight 2, um, what is this one? John the Ark, Valkyria Knights 1, R Type Connect Tactics, and this one is. I'm not even sure. Some Capcom game. I think it's a fighting game. Actually, I have no idea what that is, but that's a great little lot of games in there. Pretty, I don't have the boxes. And then I've got another whole couple of loose games in here too. God of War, Ghost of Sparta, Little Big Planet, SOCOM, and NBA The Inside, Justice League, and then a few of the movies. A uh, whole bunch of games in here. Yeah, so that's my PSP collection. As you can tell, I have quite a lot of PSP games. I love collecting for the system. I collect anything for the system. It's a really great system. Um, Sony didn't do very well with their handle systems, unfortunately, uh, but they, they did pretty well what they had. Uh, anyway, I hope you enjoyed the video. Give me a like, subscribe, um, and have a good day. Have a good weekend. I'm out.